the pressure is on Rochelle Walters Melissa Danielle Maxwell and Maxwell we were so impressed with her kicking ability sure and uh, she'll have to kick well to beat Rochelle she's got a significant height advantage Rochelle she needs to if for her to get around those kicking she that kicking she needs to be picking those points early 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 as you can see Melissa is a very very able fighter and Rochelle has got to start um, well basically start early she hasn't started early enough here and um, Melissa's got the advantage and the other thing we saw with Melissa as well was her ability to develop the kick she keeps the leg chambered yes, and she keeps does. it there so when you think the referee's going to split you when you mentioned the fact that you think the point scored she doubles up the she kick does. and scores again yeah she does she does she does she's got um she's got hands for legs isn't she really she's got her legs can do what her hands could do so She's going, to be, she's going to be a difficult opponent to beat. But Rochelle has got to go early and, and really look to start notching them points up now. The more time, the more she bounces of her, the more trouble it's going to make for her. And aggressive, coming forward. Yeah, definitely. Confident. Again, stop in, stop in, and get, that's how you're going to get caught. Stop that's in. right. Um, Rochelle thought she had the punch scored there, and that's what can happen, even with the taller opponent. Melissa came up with the kick, which also didn't score, by the way, but yeah. it just shows the dangers if you switch off. Exactly, Malcolm. Exactly. I mean, she's a confident fighter. Good point. Good point, Rochelle. Good point. Not scored there. And there's that again. spin again. That's it, but, Rache but Rochelle's timing is good. She's stepping in and she's doing the right thing. So she's effectively stepping in and um, what she needs to do is step in and just keep her, her back hand up to stop any kick coming round. But that said, I think, as you said about the hands and feet, I think Melissa, it's that aggressive style is working for her. She's, she's embraced this concept and is really pushing Rochelle at yeah, the moment. Yeah, she, she's committed. She's committed to her technique. She's committed. And she does that little shuffle there. Look, the bend of the waist is almost like it's Ali or Elvis almost there, Greg. The way she just gives <laughs> that, that little yeah. motion with the hips. Definitely, definitely. And that's it, Rochelle. Rochelle needs to stay on top of her. Don't let her get too confident because she's, she's up at the moment. I like Rochelle though, she's just really not being nice and measured, even though she's behind, she's, she's, she's focused. Melissa needs to just be a little bit more settled and go and get those points. So a little bit more settled and be focused on just getting those points. She scored two clear points with pretty basic attacks, you know, double punch and a uh, reverse punch. She needs to keep doing that. Yeah, so style, as we saw there, slightly unorthodox. And she tries to lure the punch from Rochelle to, to react with those those legs. But I think Rochelle is, is getting used she's to that she's style she's of attack. She's in, she's very true, Mark. And she's inside. And Rochelle is long, longer. She's just being smarter. She's just picking the points. Good. Well done. She's being smarter. She's just picking those points off. But it's Maxwell that goes through. Yeah, she got it because she scored, scored early. Scored early. That first point is so important, Malcolm. Getting out the blocks, scoring first, can make all the difference at the end of the fight. And, and Greg, you've said this right the way through the tournament, and it's showing to be proven true now at key moments.